Okay, I guess I got here a bit of a problem. Today as I went to pick up my 6th string guitar to play a little bit, I realized it was out of tune. And uh, as I've checked a bit better, I got a bit of a problem. Check this out. Check this out. The bar is open. It lifted up. See? See the gap? The glue came off and the bar is fucked. So I'm gonna pull out the strings, sand everything and try to glue it back in place. And if glue isn't enough, I'll put one or two bolts holding it in place. I wasn't expecting for this. That's my 6th string Guardia guitar. And uh, right now it's fucked. Alright, I'm gonna try and repair the thing. First thing I'm gonna do is pull all the strings out. Pull all the strings out. fear that would happen on, on one of these guitars and it actually happened Here a bunch of cables. And there's also here. And the bad about this is that it didn't come completely out. It kind of just just lifted partially. And so. Pretty hard to fix it. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna mask it, everything here around with tape. Okay, check this out. Got the wire for the piezo under the bar, and as I was sending the thing, it completely came out. Well, at least like this, it's easier to send.
on sanding. Okay, right now everything has been sanded properly. Everything is completely clean now. And uh, I got here, yes, you must recognize these. These are the bolts for the GoPro mounts or the SJ4000 cam, action cams. These are the mounts. And these have a nut and they fit on these holes exactly. So what I'm going to do is I will apply a lot of glue put it in place and then put these bolts through the holes I'm gonna I'm gonna fit them here so one on this side see keep the nuts on this side it's windy outside okay I got the nuts there I got the bolts try and use one more or less in the middle to do now apply glue put it in place and put those bolts and tighten them down and let it dry for tomorrow this is the kind of glue you use for wood so it should stick pretty good Gotta clean these holes. I'm gonna apply lots of glue. I'm gonna apply plenty of glue. Because I don't want it. Oh Christ. I don't want it to come off again. So I'm applying plenty. the thing more or less in place and to align it I'm gonna use one of these on one side another one on the other side and this will hopefully keep it in its exact position where it should be I made a mistake here. I put it in the wrong place. So I gotta pull it out. Because on this place what's gonna go is one of these for the GoPro. Now I'm gonna start tight tighten it down until I can feel the thread and then I'm gonna put the nut and tighten it even more so that it makes pressure
Okay, I think I reached the point I wanted. Yes, indeed. So this one on the other side. Now this one in the middle is the last one. And that's it. Or to find this one. Okay, the thing is tight in place. Clean the excess glue here around. Then I'm gonna let it dry for tomorrow. I'm gonna let it dry for tomorrow. in place and fix my problem again. Okay, let me show you guys. Right now, this is how I got it. It's completely in place. Check it out. Now I'm just gonna let it dry for tomorrow and hopefully it will be good to go. Okay, I've noticed that here on the sides it's not quite pressed yet. So what happens is that 
as I as I press on the metal with these bolts it presses good but then on the sides it's not pressed yet so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put here this one on each side I got these cans I'm gonna put the can upon it and I'm gonna put the can upon it and I'm gonna place a heavy brake disc upon the can and on this side I'm gonna do the same another can on this side and another brake disc and hopefully This will press it down, even on the sides, so that the thing glues properly. Check this out. I put the bolts. Zoom out. I put the bolts. And then I put the can picking up the side you show with the light so I put the can picking up the sides and I got the brake discs upon the cans to make a lot of weight so that it really sticks down okay now I'm just gonna let it dry for tomorrow okay so this has been drying for a couple days I already removed the weight from up here and now I'm removing these bolts and I gotta use a wrench because they get they get pretty tight in the glue so I gotta use this wrench to hold the nut inside and then rotate this it's quite hard to pull them out but at least I think Okay, so the nut, the nut is out. At least I think that the thing was properly glued in place. Right now all I have to do is put the strings and give it a try. See if it fixed the problem. Okay. Oh, yeah. Six pins. Oh, hold the strings. to send it so that they fit okay once again as they used to fit before because right now they're not fitting too easily and uh, then I'm gonna put the strings and test it I'm just using this small file to make the holes There's some glue that got in the way, and that's why those pins. Are not, that's why those pins are not going correctly in. If the 
these pins are all the same. Yeah, I guess they are. And they're tight. Just gonna send them to the point that these fit well and then put the strings. There's no science about it. Okay, now I've installed the strings, tuned the thing, and as you can see, it is okay. It is in tune. I'm just gonna play it for a couple days and see how it goes, if it holds or not, for now it's okay.